So guys, I am back with another Elden Ring Shadow of the Earth Tree video. And in this video guide, I'm going to showcase you the very best DLC Rune Farm. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So this is the best Rune Farm inside of the Shadow Realm DLC. There's no better Rune Farm on this map that I have found. Um, yes, the classic... Mogwin Palace Hill within the Siofa River is the best in the game still. But this is easily the second best. Now it takes place within the Ena Elam area, which you unlock upon you taking out the Saint of the Bud bus and then burning the ceiling tree. You then get teleported to this grace right here. And I'll showcase you exactly how you get to the grace we're going to do this farm from. Now Spiral Rise is where you want to be at and that's where we're at right here. Now what I will say is I uploaded a farm the other day which is like the other grace. Uh, this is better than that, it's a better run than that, you earn more runes doing it this way. Fewer hard hitting enemies but they are no problem if you do what I do. Weapon we are using guys is the Sacred Relic Sword, plus 10. Boosting it with an incantation of Golden Vow and my seal. And also boosting it with a couple of talismans as well as getting God and Scarab for them extra runes, obviously. And then we're using the Wondrous uh, Physic. I'm using the Holy Shroud and Kratia to boost my Holy Damage. But again, if you're using a different weapon, as long as the weapon's got decent AoE on it, you should be completely fine. But you want to buff that weapon, obviously. Now, the Golden Scarab will buff my rune drops, but you can also, guys, use... What's great about this is the Golden Horn Tenders. Now, what's great about this farm is you more or less get one of these every time you run it. I'm actually 8 up. Been running this sometimes I'm getting two or three per run. And these boost those rune drops. Now what I will say is guys, and keep this in mind, these do not stack with the gold pickled foul feet. So don't use these two together. That's really, really wasteful. I'm just gonna put this one on. Pull it on people. Just like so I'll drop my golden vow. Drink my wondrous physic. And then we just run. Then we run from so from the uh, spiral rise staircase, you run up the staircase. Just like so. Now, it's probably about a minute and a half, two minute run, but I'm getting about 200k runes here. Something like that. And remember, guys, this isn't New Game Plus. I'm not playing on New Game Plus. So if I was, that's doubling and tripling, guys. New Game Plus 2 is like, what, triple? So yeah, take these guys out. That's basically the one drops you 18,000. The other one drops you 5,000. What's not to love about that? That's just two enemies. This guy here will drop me another like 17,800 runes. Take him out. Run down here, and again, new game plus one or two, that's doubling and tripling. From here, guys, you just want to spam out your Ash of War. Just like so, do it twice and it should kill him. Boom, there you go, he's with you once, but there you go, he's dead. And he gives you, I'm not sure how much, he gives you like 15k. Then you want to jump down here, guys. Stand at this door right here, and spam out the attack. There we go. Now, those are the guys that drop you those golden horns, so keep that in mind. If they drop anything, pick it up, people. Definitely pick up. And from here, guys, just spam out the attack. And you'll see there's so many enemies down here. Listen to the rune drops. Bop, 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 bop. And manage that. Boom. Okay, so from here, guys, you run forward. Look slightly left. Spam out your attack again. Just like so. Complete steps. Spam out one more time. Drink your flask. Get that FP back. Come this way, people. Jump over here, just like so. Spam out these bugs. You can actually attack them with you, so you don't have to actually use your Ash of War there. Come to about here, guys. Let these two drop. Take them out. Run around this corner. And you want to stick right here. So jump over here to your right, otherwise that guy will latch onto you. And stick right to this wall here, just like so. Turn around. Spam out the Ash of War. Kill them all. Take them all out and get those runes. And then, guys, you simply go back to that fast travel point or the grace, the spiral rise, rinse and repeat. It really is as simple as that. But don't forget, every time you use a grace, your uh, golden horn will reset. Your golden horn tender will reset. So, yeah, keep that in mind. So, how do you get here? So upon you get into this actual place from that outer wall, if you've got this grace opened or that grace opened, it's quite easy. That's the next one along the line, but we'll go from the start. Just so people that have just got here, so they know where you can do this. Uh, so yeah, it's actually quite an easy run. So come up this way, guys. There's only one enemy in your way at this side, which is cool. 
So you can actually you can just basically run past this guy to be honest. I was farming him earlier, I got some a great helmet off him actually. He's gonna do like a distance attack. Just dodge that. Or don't dodge it because you not a scrub like me. But yeah, just run past him. Run past him. And up on your left hand side now there will be a grace. So you wanna go and activate that grace, know that this guy is chasing my ass. Yeah, there he is, look, I can hear his footsteps. <laughs> Okay, so from here, guys, we now make our way to the next one along the line, which is this one right here. Now, this is where I actually did the other farm from where I posted a couple of days back, which is decent as well, people. It is decent as well, but yeah. So from here, guys, just gonna run up, ignore these enemies. I'm just gonna run past them all. We're gonna try and run past them all anyway. It probably ain't gonna end well for me, but hey. So you run around here, run past all these, try and avoid their attacks. Try and avoid all their attacks. <laughs> Try and avoid their attacks. Not like I can do anything about it because I'm an idiot. From here, make sure you got full health. And from here, guys, we're just going to make a, a sprint. Let's make a sprint and don't stop because this guy hits pretty hard. And you want to try and get past him before he shoots his laser bolt at you. Which is coming at me now, is it? No, he missed. That's good. So from here, guys, this is where you're just going to have to dodge. And these you can slow down and take out, but for the purposes of the video, I'm just going to run. But yeah, they actually hit really hard and they spam you. Once one gets you, loads of them get you the pain in the ass. But yeah, just swear them left and right. Dodge, 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 dodge. And here is that grace. Simple as that. This is the grace you need to be at. This is that grace you need to be at. Now, instead of repeating the farm I just did, I'll show you the old one just in case you missed my last video. So we're going to fast travel back to the first Rise Grace and I'll show you an alternative route. This will, it's not quicker. Obviously, you won't earn as much runes, but it eliminates a couple of the harder hitting enemies. So yeah, so from the first Rise Grace, I can, I'm just going to pop my Physic and just uh, go on down. Don't think I'll need him here, but hey. So from here, guys, just going to run forward out of here and we're gonna come up these steps just like so and on your right hand side slightly basically we're gonna do what we just did we're gonna stand here and then just spam out attack take the ball back simple as that people simple as that now jump over here come up here then it's gonna spam this out like that boom now that guy's there, so we're just going to take him out too, because he's the, the main dude of this area. He's probably the hardest hitting one. As soon as you take him out, it's, the farm's done, people. Simple as that. There we go. What we got there? What we like to see? From here, guys, just look left and take these out. You can take the guys out on the right first, but they normally shoot at you after. So yeah, let's take them out. We're going to take these guys out here on the steps. And from here, guys, do as we just did. Whoop. That's what we like to see. Jump down here. Take these two out just like so. Come around here. Make sure these both land. And then take these out just like that. So. Almost missed that then. <laughs> Come around this corner. Remember, stick right here. So stick right, otherwise, the electric anti and just sucks the blood out of you. And stick right there as well. And then just turn around, people. Spam out that attack and get those runes it really is as simple as that guys and there we have it again this isn't on new game plus if it was you'd earn a ton more runes in doing this but remember those two don't stack together so don't try and put on the uh pickled foul feet these ones right here the gold pickled foul feet and the uh golden horn tenders these will not stack together so use one or the other but if you're using this farm you get plenty of these anyway, which is giving you a constant boost for your room gains. So yeah. But there we have it, guys. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more out of ring, be sure to subscribe and hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.